Okay, this video is dedicated to Gamshorn. Gamshorn, this is a Gamshorn, this one too, different sizes. And um, Gamshorn is uh, some sort of a medieval flute, um, medieval recorder. Uh, it's got uh, one octave tonal range and um, the sound is very mellow because technically it's a, an, an ocarina flute. So that means um, it is closed up here. If you look at it, uh, this is where you blow. Um, but it is not opened at the bottom, uh, so it makes a very mellow sound, very sweet sound. And we got these in different pitches. Um, I'll make a separate video file to each of them later. Um, but first of all, I'd like to show you that uh, so to say we cater for all tastes. <laughs> this is sub bass. So we get these in sopranino, soprano, alto, tenor, bass and sub bass pitch. Um, always tuned to C or F, um, like you do with the recorder ensemble. Um, the origin of these instruments is uh, European. Uh, so you got um, originals, for example, one piece made of clay is found somewhere in Italy. It was made in the 15th century. And um, there's other pieces, which are not complete, unfortunately, found uh, in several other places, also in Germany, for example. Um, uh, usually uh, the, the name suggests that it was made out of chamois, um, which the German word is Gemse. And so it's Gemshorn, the, the horn of a chamois. Um, but uh, actually there is no original horn being found made of uh, chamois or Gemse. But uh, nowadays you use any kind of horn that fits or is suitable for well, making such instruments. And um, in the 1960s, 1960s, uh, it came up that uh, they were built in uh, ensemble style, so you can you have sopranino, alto, and so on to play together. And um, in the Middle Ages, that was not so. Uh, most of these things were played in 15th or 16th century, and um, then there was some centuries uh, when no one was really playing this. But in the past, um, you also find pictures. For example, there is one important book, uh, historical book, um, made. Um, by music scientist Sebastian Verdun in uh, 16th century and it's called Musica Getutscht, which means like uh, German music and uh, that shows uh, the death playing uh, one of these horn recorders and um, in a danse macabre, a death dance, so to say, from those days. So it dates back a lot and um, to all those who are interested in really knowing how each of them sounds, I'll make a separate file and you'll be surely finding this uh, within the links. Thanks for your attention.